No, not really. I haven't. I'm not surprised with anything in these these times. It's challenging for everyone. Um, you know, it's easy to judge people and um, decisions that individuals are making. But until you've been put in these environments, in these positions, and had to play under these conditions, I think it's hard to pass judgment on anyone. It's an individual thing. Some guys struggle more with quarantine than others. There's, there's no there's no hiding that. That's the challenges that professional cricketers have at the moment. Um, you know, our sport is played overseas. Um, we have to go overseas to, to play and to keep the game going. We understand that. And um, individuals find it harder than the others. So um, there's no difference between, you know, what England are going through now to what every other team goes through to, to go away and play. It's, it's not easy. And I don't pass judgment on any team or any individual for the challenges that they're facing they're you know they're trying to you know work it all out um, and you know I, I, i'm confident the ashes are going to go ahead um, it's never been a doubt in my mind to be honest but yeah there are there are challenging parts of it um for the individual and for the team yeah for sure just a quick follow-up from that one um last one from me but do you think that the english side has potentially copped a bit of a bad rap about the way that they've approached it like has it been unfair that kind of treatment that you mentioned before Oh, I haven't read enough stuff to be able to pass judgment on, you know, what's really going on there. Um, I've seen a little bit of it and I've heard a little bit of it, but no, I, I, I haven't read in enough to be able to pass judgment on whether they've been treated fairly or not. Um, as I said, it's for me, it's an individual thing. You know, there's individual players in their team that I'm sure are apprehensive about coming in and doing the quarantine. There's no difference um, between, you know, the Australian cricket team coming home and having to do quarantine. There, It's apprehension and there's nerves and it's some people don't cope with it as well as others. As I said, there's, you know, we saw the Olympics, the Olympic um, people come back and, and some of those guys had challenges as well. It's, it's not easy, um, but um, that's the way it is at the moment.